The secret worlds of the elements needed to create the Philosopher's Stone were guarded for centuries by a bloodline of alchemy masters. The knowledge and the responsibility were passed down the generations. But one of the greatest alchemists among them, Gideon Bartemius, never had children, and so he had no one of his own blood to inherit the burden. But he did have an apprentice, and her name was Isabella Wood. This must be my ancestor, Isabella Wood. She looks just like me. My dear Isabella, you were always like a daughter to me. You were by far my best and most trusted apprentice. And so, with that in mind, I leave you as my successor and entrust you with the greatest responsibility of all, the protection of the Philosopher's Stone. Yes, it is real, my dear. It does exist. My family protected its secrets for generations, but the danger was always there. I am certain I found the solution. I'm going to try to put my plan into motion. If I'm not back by the time you read this letter, that means I have failed. In this envelope, you will find a spare key to my workshop, and also a recipe for a very special potion. Create the potion and drink it. I cannot say anything else, except to ask you to trust me. Everything will be clear to you in time. You will know what to do. Trust yourself as I do, Gideon Bartamius. All right, well, we'll just go ahead and grab that key and let's get cracking on the bonus chapter here. Oh, how do I get this? How do I, oh, there's two pages. Dimension Transmorgification Recipe, Ethereal Oil, Truffles, Galden Buds, I don't know how you pronounce that, Nether Dust, sounds like fun. Go ahead and start collecting our bits and pieces here, I see there's a nice code on the rock. I am loving the way this water looks, it's very pretty. Yes, that's right, I called this water... This looks like a good place to hunt truffles. Pretty. Hunting truffles, I see. Okay, we'll have to get there soon enough. I have the key, though. Let's find out what's inside the workshop. What the heck is making that noise? Uh, let's go ahead and lock the inventory here. Something's making... Oh, it's a piggy! Aww! It's an adorable piggy. I was like, what the heck is that noise? I do not see you, piggy. Uh, do we put the recipe here? Yes, we do. So we still need a whole bunch of stuff. Oh, okay, maybe not. Do we have it? Master's ring. The potion's not ready yet. This is where the ingredients are added. Okay, so we don't really have the ingredients. There was a code outside. Uh, is this where that ring goes? Yes, it does. Okay, it probably would be helpful if I actually paid closer attention to the code. So it's A, arrow, plant, triangle. A, arrow, plant, Triangle. There we go. What do we got there? A vial of nether dust. Sure, we'll put that in there. We're going to need some sort of shovel for the truffles, I imagine. And I don't know where we're going to get those buds from, but we'll figure it out. Empty jug. Whoa, holy cow. Okay, so we're going to have to come back to this, sure. We only have one out of two. Aw, Piggy. Oink, oh, oink. this little guy looks hungry and thirsty. Maybe if I feed him, he can help me find some truffles. Yeah. So we need some water. 
I'm gonna grab some water. Come on, Jug. That's old school Jug. See if the water is enough to satisfy him. Piglet. Come with me, piggy. Come on. Are you done drinking or what? Oh, this little guy looks hungry and thirsty. Maybe if I feed him, he can help me find some truffles. Okay, so... That's cool and all, but, uh... Uh, I can almost reach those branches. Let's use this then. Got ourselves some wild plums. Maybe that's what our piggy wants. Here, I'll have some wild plums. And then we have to go hunting for truffles. I have a piglet! And it's very useful! Thank you. Come with me. We're on a hunt for truffles. <laughs> I like the way it's looking around. Oh, who's a good piggy? Ooh, I'll take that too. Alright, you stay out there and keep hunting for truffles. We still need those buds though. Maybe they're in here somewhere. Alright, let's find out what we have to do here. Match the labels on the jars to the symbols on the blocks. Move the jars to the right positions in the shelf. Alright, well, we're just going to go ahead and, uh... I don't know, we'll just do colors for now. And then we'll get to the symbols soon enough. Red goes there. Put that there. There must be a red one in the wrong spot somewhere. Or maybe the color doesn't matter? I don't know. Alright, let's find A1. A1, done. ZV. Right there. That's actually the right one. We need double triangles. Eight. Get that one there. Let's see here. Where does this one go? Oh no, that's not right either. That one definitely goes there. No, that's not right either. Where does this one go? <laughs> oh, down there. Alright, we're just going to do this in a random order, apparently. Because, you know, sure. Z3. Where's double triangle? Four. I don't see double triangle four. Oh, right there, of course. Okay, that's good for that. And then we'll do... Z2 belongs there. That goes there. Yay! Oh, there's our beads or whatever. Buds? Sorry, buds. I'm not sure why. Beads, but... All right, stir that up and slurp it back. Mmm, nom nom. Oh, it's like magic mushrooms. <laughs> Craden, drink the special potion. I sure did do that. Master Gideon. Intruder, you will burn. Whoa, <laughs> holy crap. Master Gideon, it's me, Isabella. Something's wrong. Some dark force has taken him over. He didn't even recognize me. I'll have to pay. Oh, I'll have to help him, but first I need to take care of this fire. And I got nothing for... 
carrying around water here. We're gonna have to figure something out here. I need a paddle. This must be the soul medallion recipe. All I need is some lichen, a devil's tooth mushroom, and a doll's eyes flower. Sounds legit to me. Isabella, this place has been taken over by dark energies and I can feel them taking me over too. They prey on my doubts and fears. They're the cause of the anger growing inside of me, and sometimes I can't remember who I am anymore. If I get lost, the only thing that can save me is the soul medallion. You can create it here, just follow the instructions. That is a pretty flower. I mean, feather. What's wrong with me? Why did I say flower? So... That's no ordinary fire. Let's go this way then. There's dew on this plant. I need a small container to gather it. What do we have here? Bioluminescent crystal creation. Ooh. What the heck's going on here? I need to repair the rope so I can pull the net out of the water. There could be something useful under the algae. How the heck do I get the algae out of here? What do we have here? Ooh, hidden object seed. Some string? I bet some beautiful cloths. Oh, clothes can we make from this loom? Piece of string. Hmm. Alright, let's go ahead and get cracking here. Oh, we need bottles, do we? Let's see if we can find them all. Well. We're going to obviously have to eventually find them all. That's how it works. Empty bottle. That's for dew. Here is the dew. Gather up the... Oh! Bottle's too large, apparently. Can I just get water here, then? No, apparently not. No, there's no water here, either. What else can we do here? I see nothing. Let's go back to this spot. Maybe we can get water this way? Sure we can. I wonder if that'll be enough to put the fire out. We'll try. No. Crud. Bottle of icy water? No, that won't work either. I could make a broom out of this. Sure you could. Now I need to cut it. What the feather? <laughs> Crap. So many things I can't do right now. It's kind of maddening. So, can I just pour water on this? Like what it... I don't know how I'm supposed to get this algae out of here. Ah, nice flat surface. I'm not sure why we need a flat surface, but that's cool. Alright, game, what the hell? What's. I don't. Oh! Whatever this is. Alter Sigil. Okay. So now we have to go back here, apparently. I could create a magic fire inhibitor potion here. I just need some ice-cold water, a hyacinth flower, a feather, and some dew. Okay. I have that. Ooh, the guardian creation. Gather all the elements required to create the guardian. Wow, that's kind of crazy. I have to create the guardian? Wow. Okay, I don't know. Oh, maybe this is for the algae. Sure, we'll go with that. Oh wait, can we cut this? Yeah, there we go. Take that with me. Anything in here I can cut? No, I don't think so. Hmm. Okay, so we're still gonna need to figure out how to move that over there. Uh, 
Where are you gonna take me, game? Here. I am here. Here then. Uh, maybe this is for the algae? Yeah, I think so. Whoa, look at all this good stuff here. Move the debris to find all the red shells. Uh, whoa. Come on, stop being so sticky. No, I didn't mean to get out of that. How many do I need? Oh, there's one. Another one's still. How many are there, game? Just these two, maybe? No, nope, another one. Red shells! Maybe that's for gathering dew? No, not a chance. Hmm. Well, we can put that in there. More ingredients are missing. Oh, I still have that bottle, that's weird. I still need something else. Want some shells? No, shells for you. Okay, let's go back here then. Am I supposed to use this on this? No. Magic fire inhibitor potion. Yeah, okay, so we're working on that. Oops, I didn't mean to go here. Can I use these to row? No. That's just crazy talk. Okay, so what the heck am I missing here then? Ah. Uh, okay. Again? No, that won't work here. Shells? Oh. No such luck. Oh, you know what? Maybe the vine will work on the net. Maybe. Oh, there we go. Ooh! Bioluminescent? Maybe? Think that'll lure in our friends? We'll find out. Crap. <laughs> no, it doesn't. Pretty crazy game. So, I don't know. Uh, I'm not sure why I care if it's flat or not. I don't think I understand what we've got going on here. We're back here now. What the heck are we doing here? There's nothing to do here. I'm clicking everything game. So I'm at a loss. Wow, that was a tiny, tiny thing to find, but anyways, we got it, and I think we're ready to make ourselves one of these fire potion things, fire suppressing potions, or whatever it was. Yeah, I should I hurry and extinguish the fire before it spreads. Let's do that, then. Splash that all over there. Yay! So much detail in these scenes here. Very impressive. Ah! Well, that can't be good. What happened? Where am I? I have to find a way out. I can't reach it. Alright, so what do we got to gather up here? Some stuffs. Oh, look, pomegranate. Mmm. It does look juicy. 
I think pomegranate might actually be in season where I am right now. From what I recall. Okay, I don't even know what I did to the pomegranate, but... Where's that nut? Gotcha. Walnut. Oh, look, a 12-sided die. <laughs> We're gonna play some Dungeons and Dragons. Uh, I think I've played it maybe last year. I have like the beginner's kit for Dungeons and Dragons. Whoa, I didn't even know we were still looking for morphing objects. Apparently we are. So how am I supposed to get up here? It says I need one of three. I'll use the bone on this. Two out of three. Oh, no, actually, never mind. Okay, let's find out what we gotta do here. Enter the correct combination of symbols as seen on the right side. Ah, uh, what? So we want this one? Which means we gotta move two? How do I do this? I don't think I understand what I'm... Oh, I gotta do this one first. Okay, okay, never mind. So I need to go back. One, two, three, four. Alrighty then. How am I gonna do this next one? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And then we have to go to that way. And then we have to go one, two, three. And then we have to go one, two, three, four, five. I don't have five. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Then we have to go one, two, three, four. And then one, two, three. Woohoo, we did it! Ooh, what do we have over here? Ooh, I like swords. It's like a broadsword to me. A way out. Yeah, finally a way out. 